Hey guys, it's X bringing you another Call of Duty Advanced Warfare live commentary, and don't worry, I'm going to be blending in live commentary and post commentary normally, so don't worry about the choice of one or the other. Some people seemed concerned with that. I got a long range support build that I kind of put together. I'm tempted to. Yeah, let's try that this Team video. Let's try that Seven out this three. video. Up, let's see what I can do here. We're going to put this drone out, see if the drone can find anything. Looks like it's seeking some targets inside. I just shot a guy. There we go. Shot him twice. I got the assist on it. But apparently standing still is a bad idea. Alright. So let's see if we can pick off any targets from up here. Got a nice long-lasting cloak. I don't think this map's really good for a long-range support style build. Might just go straight back to my heavy. Because some of this stuff takes place in cramped areas and so... Whoa! Yeah, see? I really need my heavy build for this, so we're gonna go change loadout, heavy. You gotta uh, adjust your build and your playstyle to the map you're playing. This will work a lot better. On other maps, I can protect teammates and stuff with a long-range rifle. Here, uh, it's better to do my thing thusly. Oh, he's got a purple laser. Alright, so we're sitting at 814. I think I can turn that around single-handedly. Sounds kind of arrogant, but just give me a second to get used to the... to get used to the game here. get my footing, so to speak. Nice. Well, that was one to one. Gotta keep your eye on the mini-map. And on what's in front of you, apparently. Gotta do them both. That was two for one, so I actually helped my team catch up a little bit there. Gotta keep moving. Are we outnumbered? Yeah, we are. That changes things a bit. It just seemed like we had far fewer good guys on the map than bad. So far, I'm at least two for one on this run. On this particular. Whoa, I gotta reload. for one. Oh, got somebody following me. Ah, that's no good. Alright, so that was four for one, I think. Yeah. Maybe I can't single-handedly turn this around. Enemy UAV above! From behind, of course. Okay, so they got a UAV out there. They're gonna see me through walls and stuff. Really easy to get picked off when there's a UAV in the air. Enemy care package incoming. Gotta keep moving and keep moving fast. Getting the fresh 
Our UAV is online. We're losing this fight! Ah! Almost got a melee hit off on him. Took out their turret. Not sure if that was the best way to do it. Forty-three to sixty. But being outnumbered as we are, I think I'm okay. Put the grenade out there. Everyone puts the everyone puts the grenade out there next, and then I capitalize. Everyone's like, well, I can't get through his shield, so I might as well use a grenade, right? <laughs> People want to keep meleeing me in this little room. I had no idea what was coming. I don't know. This is a fun match. Even if it's going to result in a loss, I'd like to put it up. <laughs> ah, that was good. That was a fun little fight. We 1v1'd there. Everyone left us alone for a little bit. Oh, okay. We failed our objective. Sentinel retreat. Okay, well, that was no problem, really. I had a fun time this particular match. And really, I just wanted to get this video out so that I'd have something up today. Because I'm currently editing Far Cry 4 footage. Let's see. That's five versus... Man, well, we were outnumbered by at least one or two. That match. No problem. Uh, armory items have expired. That's cool. Alright, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was a loss, but I think there was some pretty fun gameplay in there. I had a lot of fun with this particular match, and it just goes to show that you can have fun while losing. And you can enjoy a match that you lost, and really not have it bother you. Alright, well, thanks a lot for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.